The offset tool found in the basic palette or activated by pressing shift minus on your keyboard has multiple applications. The tool primarily allows you to create an offsetted duplicate of an object at a user-defined distance. The contrast between the offset tool and tools like the mirror tool or even the duplicate command is that it will reshape the resulting object based on the distance you have defined for the offset. For instance, if you offset one side of a path, the offsetted shape will be correctly scaled to match the original, accounting for the distance between the two. The offset tool has four modes and a preferences dialog. The first two modes of the tool will allow you to control what method will be used to offset the object. The last two modes will control the resulting geometry and whether or not it will be duplicated. Offset by distance mode requires you to define the distance that you want your object to be offset by and a side of the object to offset to. While duplicate and offset mode will ensure that the object you have selected is duplicated when the offset command is executed. If you do not already have an object selected, hold the command key on a Mac or the control key on a Windows PC to temporarily activate the selection tool and select the object you wish to offset. Enter a desired offset distance into the distance field. You then need to choose a side of the object you want your duplicate to be created on. On your next click, Vectorworks will execute the command and duplicate your object at the distance you have defined. The other two modes of the offset tool are offset by point mode and offset original object mode. Offset by point mode allows you to use your cursor to define a distance and shows a preview of the resulting geometry. Offset original object mode will simply offset whatever object is selected and not create duplicates. With an object you wish to offset selected, click on an area around it. A preview will display of where the object will be offset to. On your next click, the command will execute and offset your object. The offset tool preferences contain the same controls that you have in the toolbar with additional offset controls for when offsetting walls and two other checkboxes. The smooth corners option will smooth out any sharp corners of the offsetted objects. The close open curves option will make the offset tool create closed polygons. The offset tool is excellent for creating objects that maintain an exact distance from existing geometry, such as fencing, complex bending paths, or other perimeter-dependent geometry.